at least three laps. I was born in uh, September 28, 1920. Never thought I would bypass my grandfather. 96, I said, that's a long time. <laughs> and here I am, 90, 99. Try to stay active, keep the body active. He's dedicated to his here when it's cold, when it's hot, when it's raining, when most of us don't want to get up and come work out. I, I asked him one time if they could they open up at 7, but <laughs> they said no, the government won't let them do it. And you know, every now and then we'll have somebody that's new that has met him and they'll come up, did you know that man's 99 and he's killing it in the, in the fitness room. I can be at home and if I have an exercise, I say I'm going to put it off until tomorrow. That little voice will come and say, you get out of here and go exercise. But, uh, I don't know where the voice is coming from, but I, that's what, I, get, I, I hear something, but I, it's not vocal, but I can hear it. And I just get up and go exercise. I got rid of arthritis in my back like this. About three months of exercise, so it went away and I didn't even know it. Go to the big machine over here. So I'll do 10 of these. My service, I went to Germany, went in after big and bacon there in France. And as soon as the war ended there, we thought we were coming home. No, they sent us over to Japan. We went there to fight, but we didn't have to fight. The atomic bomb dropped while we were on the way, and that ended the war. It's about five minutes to do one lap. They got to get started. They got, to, they, got to, they got to move, get off of that seat. <laughs> I used to do the 10 pound, then I went to the 12. And I just have, have a belief that uh, there's a higher being than man, you know, so I think if I keep that belief, I think I, I'll, I'll do all right. That's it. <laughs> yeah.